Hey everybody, how you doing today? Uh, we got some things to cover. Starting off with the limited mintage uh, news and announcement. Uh, effective July 1st, which is today, uh, they're not going to be selling directly to us anymore. They're basically going to become a wholesale company. And so uh, because of the, it says, you know, the sales tax, right? The online sales tax, collection laws, and the time consumed in retail sales, we believe this change will best serve all of our customers. So we will have to buy through these four dealers, uh, Atmax, JM Bullion, Provident, and SD Bullion will be carrying uh, Intaglio Mint's uh, uh, products here. So uh, if you go to their site, uh, I think they're pretty much all gonna say, oh, you can't even, yeah, you can't even like get there. It's like kind of slow. Um, I don't even know if it's gonna change to another page anymore. So pretty much that's the way it is for limited vintage. So uh, not to worry though, you know, you'll be able to buy from these other dealers. And as most of you know, gold has been around uh, 1405 to 1425 for the past week or so. And now we have uh, pulled back uh, like usual. You know, I was saying, should we be selling our gold now in one of my previous videos? And most people had uh, inclination to hold where some people actually did sell, you know, so that's a pretty good profit for people who bought gold in the 1200 and sold at 1400 not too shabby, right? And um, I think it had something to do with China and the, you know, uh, the U.S. agreement with the trade. Um, uh, at least they spoke about it or they uh, coming to a tentative deal or something like that so that um, uh, the markets rallied and gold has pulled back. And I'll show you. Here's the um, year-to-date chart of the Dow Jones here. And, you know, um, uh, it, it rallied up 117 points today. Uh, maybe it'll go to 30,000. We'll see, you know, but it all depends on earnings. Uh, I did see a notice from Yahoo Finance saying that earnings are not going to be good this coming, uh, you know, earnings season, but we'll see, okay? And for those of you who are uh, Rwanda Nautical Series collectors, uh, the third one came out um, just recently. And if you click there, we're going to see the newer ones. You have the bullion, you have the proof, and you have the gold. Gold is not available yet. I don't know why, but let's take a look at the bullion first. See how many they made of these. Um, it doesn't say what the mintage is. Multiples and 10, okay. So I guess it's not limited for the BU, um, or they may, it they, they might be uh, limited, but we don't know until later, right? And then we'll check the proof coin. Um, I like it. This is really nice, you know, since it's not going to ship out till July 18th, but I never really bothered to start collecting. They only made a mintage of a thousand, so that's relatively low for a proof coin. So yeah, I don't know if uh, any of you are collecting these, but... Uh, just wanted to let you know that it's available. So I'll leave a link down below for this page that gives you access to all of these. And it looks like the, you know, we had the 2018 and we had the 2017. Um, the, the designs are, you know, they kind of look the same, you know, but if you look at, let's say the 2018, the ship is kind of uh, moving away, you know, not not towards you, but away. It's going towards the right. And then if you look at um, this one here, which is the new one, it's coming towards you. So I guess it's all like perspective and angles that they try to do to make the uh, coin look nice, you know, every year. And we have upcoming releases from the Perth Mint, which is going to be released in another half hour or so uh, after I upload it. Um, because it's going to be July 2nd in Perth Mint time. So the one that I was looking at, I, I know some of you are collectors of the Simpson, so they're going to have the Marge Simpson proof coin. And um, you have the Double Dragon 2-ounce silver antique coin. Not sure what that's going to look like yet, but you know, once it gets released, I'll do another video and cover some of these. The rest of them, I don't think uh, people are really all that interested. Double Sovereign maybe? You know, this one might be interesting to some people because people like the sovereigns. Um, 
and I don't really know much about this welcome stranger or you know ancient Egypt Egypt antique coin you know but if they look good you know I'll, I'll do a video and cover them so uh, I'll leave a link down below for the forthcoming releases and silver eagles uh, kind of the same uh, you can get it from DBS coins on eBay for 365 that seems to be the best price and bullion exchange around 370 so you get the 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 estimate in prices so far um, you know we we would like to see it down to like 345 340 even 335 but right now it's gonna be like this because silver is 15 um, 15 and change and I think I saw a video by Bull Pony um, he does like you know um, Elliott wave forecasting or something like that and uh, he's been very accurate with the, the crypto uh, projections but not so much with metals you know and um, he's been predicting gold and silver to shoot to the moon like so many times and he's been wrong uh, but he says go going forward in July he thinks silver is going to make a move so um, if I find that video I'll leave a link down below if you guys if you guys want to watch it I'll leave it down below too as for gold deals um, this kangaroo here this is a new one uh, 1416 so it's not all the best but if you use your 2% cashback credit card you know you'll pretty much get it close to spot I don't think it'll be below spot but it'll be close to spot and um, another one here we got the Cougaran 1402 this is not what you would call 999 uh, gold right so um, but if you want one of these uh, I'll leave a link down below as well okay so um, I have another video coming up which we're gonna talk about um, it's called the pride of two nations coin limited edition so I'll do a separate video on it because there's some uh, things we should discuss about so um, I'll leave it at that for this one and um, yeah that's it basically we're we're caught up with some of the stuff that I had in my mind and uh, if you have any comments or questions you can leave them down below and uh, if you're brand new to the channel please hit the subscribe and notification button and if you found the video useful please give it a thumbs up all right thanks for watching and i'll speak to you in the next video